start with our hello song. And I kind of have a new one today, so it should be pretty cool. different a different hello song than what I've been doing okay as I said before if you're just hopping on um this is Kendall's Corner and we're gonna be doing this at 11 a.m. every week every day um, so I'll be consistent at 11 a.m. so um, if you want to this this week um, this week our theme is life skills so we're gonna be working on different life skills and today we're going to be doing hand washing which is so famous right now imagine that so we're going to be doing hand washing and so with the hand washing we're going to be doing what you need to wash your hands how to wash your hands so the step-by-step -step process and then when you should wash your hands so we're going to be addressing all three of those today and so first we're going to start off with what you need to wash your hands and um yeah, if you want to go along and like actually wash your hands when we do the step-by-step -step process, that's great. You can do that too, but um, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna do that so I can give directions and all that fun stuff. So first we're gonna see what we need to wash our hands. So let's start. I'll hold up some pictures and you'll tell me if yes, this is something you need to wash your hands or no, this is something you don't need to wash your hands. What do we need to wash our hands? Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands? To wash our hands today. Okay. So if we're washing our hands, which picture is a picture of our hands? Is it this one or is it this one? Right, it's this one. We are washing our hands. Good work. Okay. What do we need to wash our hands? Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands? To wash our hands today. Okay. Here's our first picture. Hmm, what is this? And do we need it to wash our hands? Right, it's a hand towel so we can dry our hands when we're done washing them. Do we need this to wash our hands? Or the step-by-step -step process? Give me a thumbs up or a thumbs down. Yes, this is something we use when we're washing our hands. Nice work, everybody. What do we need to wash our hands? Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands? To wash our hands today. Okay, here is our next one. Hmm. Is this something we use to wash our hands? No, we don't use this to wash our hands. What is this? It's a shirt. No, we don't use this to wash our hands. We use the towel to dry our hands off, but not a shirt. What do 
we need to wash our hands? Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands? To wash our hands today. Okay, here's our next picture. Is this something we need to wash our hands? Hmm. What is this? It's a sink, and yes, we do need a sink to wash our hands. Good work, everybody. What do we need to wash our hands? Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands? To wash our hands today. Okay, here's our next picture. Is this something we use to wash our hands? No, we don't use this to wash our hands. What is this? That's right, it's a table. Good work, everybody. We do not use a table when we wash our hands. This is the way we wash our hands. Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands? To wash our hands today. Okay, here's our next picture. Hmm, is this something we use when we are washing our hands? No, what is this? This is a fork. We use forks to eat, but we don't use them to wash our hands. Nice work, everybody. Okay, let's do some more. We need to wash our hands, wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands, to wash our hands today? Okay, here's our next picture. Hmm, what is that? It's water. Is water something we use to wash our hands with? Yes, we do use water to wash our hands. Okay, this is a kind of, well, it's not really a tricky question, but um, when you wash your hands, should the water be cold or warm? Cold or warm? This is a tricky question. Yes, the water should be warm when we are washing our hands. Good job. What do we need to wash our hands? Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need to wash our hands? To wash our hands today. Okay. Is this something we need when we wash our hands? Hmm, what is that? A toothbrush. Do we use a toothbrush when we wash our hands? No, you're right. We use a toothbrush when we brush our teeth. Nice work, everybody. Okay, we have our last one. What do we need when we wash our hands? Wash our hands, wash our hands. What do we need when we wash our hands? Wash our hands today. Okay, here's our last picture. Hmm, is this something we use to wash our hands? Yes, this is a bar of soap. We use soap when we wash our hands. Good work, everybody. Okay, now that we know what we need to wash our hands with, let's do the steps. The steps on in washing our hands. I have all the steps right here, so we're gonna go along and we're gonna check mark each one. Let me get a, grab a marker. We're gonna go along and check off each step as we do them. Okay, 
and I'm gonna hold up a picture for each step. Let's wash our hands. Let's wash our hands. We gotta wash our hands to wash the germs away. First we, ha! Huh. What's the first step in washing our hands? What do you think? The first step to washing our hands. When we go to the sink, what do we need to do? Hmm. Turn on the water. That is our first step. Our first step is turning on the water. Okay, so we have to turn on the water. First we have to turn on the water and I can wash the germs away. Yes, I can wash the germs away. All right, let's wash our hands. Let's wash our hands. We gotta wash our hands to wash the germs away. Next we, so we turn on the water. What do we do after we turn on the water? After we turn on the water, what is next? Hmm, what's next guys? Right, we have to wet our hands. We have to get our hands wet. So that is the second step in washing your hands. We have to turn on the water and then wet our hands. And I'm gonna wash the germs away. Yes, I'm gonna wash the germs away. Okay, let's wash our hands. Let's wash our hands. Gotta wash our hands to wash the germs away. Next we, so we, we turned on the water and then we wet our hands. So after turning on the water and wetting our hands, what is the next step? After we get our hands wet, what is next? This step involves some bubbles. That's my favorite part about washing our hands. What is the next step? Right, we have to get soap. We have to get our soap. All right, so we got, we got our soap. We have to turn on the water and wet our hands and get the soap. And I, I can wash my germs away. Yes, I can wash my germs away. Okay, let's wash our hands. Let's wash our hands. We gotta wash our hands. Turned on the water. Oh, get my get your pictures. We turned on the water. We wet our hands and we got our soap. So after we do all of that, what do we do next? After we have the soap in our hands, what do we do next? Hmm. Hmm. Okay, did you get it yet? I think I know. Right, we rub the soap. We rub our hands together and get a good lather with the soap. How many, does anybody know how many seconds you should wash your hands for? 20 seconds. You should wash your hands and lather your hands for 20 seconds. You can sing the ABCs twice, or you can sing through the alphabet twice, and that should be about 20 seconds. Okay, so now that we're rubbing our hands together, here's our steps. We have to turn on the water, then wet our hands, then get the soap, then rub our hands together, and I can wash the germs away. Yes, I can wash the germs away. Let's wash our hands. Let's wash our hands. Wash our hands to wash the germs away. Next we, so we 
turned on the water, we wet our hands, we got our soap, and then we rubbed our hands together with the soap in our hands. So after 20 seconds of rubbing your hands and getting all that good soap and rubbing it around, what is next? We have to, we have to get all the soap off of our hands somehow. So, hmm, what is next? We have to rinse the soap off our hands, yeah. So we turned on the water, then we wet our hands, then we got the soap, then we rubbed the soap. Now we're rinsing off our hands, and I can wash my germs away, yes I can wash my germs away. Okay. What's next? Let's find out. Hmm. This one is not... I don't have a picture for this one, so you're gonna have to guess. Okay, so after we turned on our water, we wet our hands, we got our soap, we rubbed our soap, then we rinsed off our hands. Now we have to, hmm, I didn't have a picture for this one. I forgot to print it. After we rinsed off our hands, we have to turn off our, so the water's running, so we have to Turn it off. Good job. So we turned on the water, then we wet our hands, then we got our soap, then we rubbed the soap together, then we rinsed off our hands, then we turned off the water, and I can wash my germs away. Yes, I can wash my germs away. Let's wash our hands. Let's wash our hands. We gotta wash our hands to wash the germs away. So what is the last step? After we turned off the water, we have wet hands. What do we do with our wet hands? Hmm. What do we do with our wet hands? Da, 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 da. We have to dry our hands. We have to dry our hands off. So we turned on the water, then we wet our hands, then we got our soap, then we lathered together, then we rinsed the soap off, then we turned off the water, and then we dried our hands. And I can wash the germs away, yes I can wash the germs away. Let's sing it all together. See if you can remember all of them. Let's wash our hands. Let's wash our hands. Wash our hands to wash the germs away. First we turn on the water, then we wet our hands, then we get the soap, then we rub the soap together, then we rinse our hands off, then we turn off the water, then what's last? Then we dry our hands and I can wash my germs away, yes I can wash my germs away. I can wash my germs away, yes I can Good job. Okay, so we, we know what we need to wash our hands and then we know all of the steps to wash our hands. So we know all of that. So now let's, Now we're going to um, come up with a bunch of ideas or a bunch of, yeah, a bunch of ideas of when, when do we need to wash our hands or when should we wash our hands? So I have to grab a marker. Um, all you need for this part is, or you can just say it out loud. You don't have to write them down. You need a piece of paper or a dry erase board or something to write with, something to write on. And... That's basically it. 
grab my paper. I lost my dry erase marker, but that's okay. Okay, so we're gonna come up with different ways or different times when you should wash your hands. So we're gonna do one at a time, and if you have, if you have an idea, write it down in the comments, or you can share it with me later. Okay. When should we wash our hands? When should we wash our hands? When should we wash our hands to wash the germs away? So when should we wash our hands? Hmm. I'm gonna come up with one and then I'll hold it up. Hmm. I got a good one. Okay, here is mine, and I realize it's probably gonna be backwards in the camera. My first one is before you eat. So anytime you eat, you should always wash your hands before you eat so you can get all the germs off and it doesn't go onto your food. Okay, let's do another one. Did anybody else come up with that one for their first one? Hmm. What, mm, sorry. germs away okay so let's come up with our next one hmm. okay so this is our second one hmm. oh I got a good one okay and you don't have to write these down if you don't want to. You can just say them out loud, too. Okay, again, this is probably backwards. But my second one is after you cough or sneeze. So you should always wash your hands after you cough or sneeze. Okay, let's do our third one. To our third one, number three. I think I have a good one for this one too. Okay. What did you guys get for your number three? I got after you pet a dog or a cat. So if you have a pet at home, a dog or a cat, after you pet them, you should always clean your hands off. Okay, now we're gonna do a fourth one. So here's number four. When should you wash your hands? When should you wash your hands? When should you wash your hands to wash the germs away? Okay, number four. Number four, number four. Hmm. Has anybody got a good one for this one? Hmm. Ooh, I got one. Okay. So mine is, everyone should be doing this already if you know not to or if you know to or not, after you use the bathroom. You should always wash your hands after you use the bathroom. That's a, that's a given, right? Maybe that was your first one that you did. Let's do, let's do one more. When should you wash your hands? This is our last one. So our fifth 
One. When should you wash your hands? I have a good one. Okay. Okay, for number five, again, I think this is backwards. After you, after you are done playing outside, so you don't know what you've touched outside, so you wanna come in and wash your hands immediately after and get all those germs off. everybody and if you want to you can keep these lists hang them on your fridge or maybe even above your sink to give yourself reminders of when you should be washing your hands and again it's not just for these five there are tons of tons of different situations that you could be washing your hands right now if you touch a doorknob or really touch anything with a handle that other people have been touching you should go wash your hands too this is very important right now especially but you still should be doing it all the time Okay, well that's all the time that we have for today. So I'm just gonna sing a little goodbye song and I will see you guys tomorrow with a different life skill. Okay. So long, farewell to you my friends. Goodbye for now until we meet again. I said so long, farewell to you my friends. Goodbye for now until we meet again. All right, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow.